Mm. Bro, during the yeah. concert, I can't get over how Mat like you could hear Mataraf all like screaming from the back. It's crazy. Holy yeah. shit! From during the second round. Oh my god. Her voice is too recognizable. Yeah, Mataraf's voice is recognizable. People like recognize Kudo immediately. By the way, it was like holy. Sh like he wasn't very slick. I think he's just very recognizable with the like, sunglasses and stuff, right? A lot of guildies and Yurei's like pointed mm. him out. I think, right? His voice is very unique too. Yeah, yes. yeah. dude, Kuro has no. such a <laughs> oh my god, he has such a unique <laughs> voice. Wait, wait, what? It's like yesterday when we went to old karaoke. Mm -hmm. I really like when he sang uh, "Believer" by Imagine Dragon. When he sings like "Pain," Pain. Yeah, he sounds like he's Rock real. Da, 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 da. <laughs> the bro sounds like he's in the actual pain, like Pain. Yeah, yeah uh, karaoke of Kuro is funny, <laughs> dude. But holy shit, he, yeah, like, like his voice. It is so recognizable. <laughs> Whenever we're out in public and he like talks yeah. really loudly, I'm just I get a little worried sometimes because mm. I'm like, fuck, bro. Like, it's just yeah. it, it, his his voice carries. Mm. He is recognizable in itself too. He's mm. fucking sunglasses. The fact that he wears like a coat all the time. Yeah. Fucking, dude, this guy brought a coat <laughs> to Thailand. He got, you know, know something the, else. He's not. He bought a trench coat. Yeah, he dressed up like he's in the winter country. Or yes. Something. Holy yeah. fuck, man. Wow. I, I, kuro, right? Kuro. Oh yeah, Kuro. K9 Kuro. He, he, he dressed like he's in the winter country. Yeah, he has jack. He has jackets. Jacket. And sweater. No. Oh. Yeah. No, you kill yourself. Yeah. <laughs> like, in the, do you yeah. remember in the second day when you wear the long sleeve? I was like, are you serious, bro? Well, that's because we were inside most of the time, so it was fine, right? And we were just doing work and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It wasn't that bad, but for yeah. him, he was outside all the time walking around. Yes. That's different. This dude bought, he bought, guys, he bought a trench coat. He <laughs> fucking came, rolled up into karaoke with a fucking trench coat. I looked at this motherfucker and I was like, dude, <laughs> ain't no way. Like, you have to be joking right now. You, you're either stupid or you're fucking stupid because he, he, he was hot. I knew mm -hmm. he was fucking hot. Yeah. Holy shit. I can't way. do that. Yeah. Yo, what? I was like so proud seeing Kuro drinking Corona beer. Oh, yeah, you drink Corona. Yeah, yeah. Corona beer. I was like, that's a big man privilege. Oh my god. Yeah. He grew up. Yeah. Proud of him. Oh my him. god, that guy, that guy is uh, something else. I'll tell you what. The first day, no! the, the first day we went out with Kuro, Matara, Yusan, and uh, Kami, right? What happened was just like, bro, uh, fucking Yuzan ordered like 20 dishes or some shit. No, 20. 20? That's uh, 18, 17. <laughs> 17. 17. Dude, what do you mean? That's still like almost 20, bro. I thought you guys are hungry. Uh, Kuro wasn't hungry, apparently, and so was Kami. Kami he doesn't wa eat Kami anything. Wasn't that Dude, oh, he... Oh, I'll get to that later. I, oh my god. We'll get to yeah. that later. Every time a new dish came out, like Kudo was sitting next to me, right? And he had the funniest expressions. Like this guy, <laughs> like whenever he saw a new dish come out, he's like, what the fuck? There's more? <laughs> and uh, like, it just didn't stop because by the 10th dish, you think like it'd be over. Oh, but then came the 11th dish, the 12th dish, the 13th dish, the 14th dish. And we're just like, holy shit. Why bruh, is there so much bruh. food? It's, I can't eat all of know, this. If you're in Thailand, you can stay hungry you know? i know but that's you overkill can. no that it's was illegal, overkill bro. bro it's illegal like, i have to be right no i get it i i, I understand right, that because i'm the same yeah, way yeah. i'd rather order more, more food than yeah. there be not enough food right yeah but there's this 18 dishes is no 17 17 you admit you said 18 bro didn't you say 18 did i i don't know, I don't know. Okay, okay, yeah, right. Right. Yeah, that yeah. Your it's called it being a good friend. Yeah. See? After, yeah, but after we ate there, the funniest thing was like we went to this um, what cafe, right? And fucking Kudo orders tomato soup and grilled <laughs> cheese. He Stop. Kudo ordered tomato soup and grilled cheese while he was there and ate all of that. <laughs> that I was guy, like, I bruh. Mean, you know what? <laughs> There's I no way this guy just did that. <laughs> I can never understand that guy, I guess. That guy's really strange. It was strange. so fucking that funny. That guy's so really strange. <laughs> oh my god. It was crazier. Oh, poor Yuzan. No, no, what's crazier is Kudo had lasagna before he had that meal with us. Oh, that's so funny shit. And it was bad lasagna. He, why did he... He can't... Dude, he comes to Thailand. <laughs> he flies in from Japan to Thailand in a puffy coat. Right? <laughs> 
he buys a trench coat, right? This guy eats lasagna as one of his first meals of the in day Thailand. before coming to this Thai restaurant with all of us. Mm -hmm. Doesn't eat any of the food at the Thai restaurant. Proceeds to go to the cafe with us, gets tomato soup and grilled cheese. Couple days later, yeah, this guy also is eating fucking uh, yakiniku by himself today. Yeah, just all alone. He's alone. He was alone today eating yakiniku by himself. I can't believe it, bro. Oh my god. Yeah, he, he doesn't know how to eat. Why is he eating yakiniku <laughs> oh right now? In Thailand. In Thailand. <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand what is going on, bro. He's like actively avoiding everything that yeah, I've been, I've been consuming. That's crazy. Oh my god. Oh my god, Kuro.